Yo guys, Code Life here. So in today's video, I'll be showing you guys how to spot llamas as soon as you jump out of the battle bus in Fortnite. I'll start off with explaining the sentence that you'll need to do this first, then I'll show you guys the method on how to actually spot them. And yes, this method is possible on every platform. You can do this on PC, PS4, xbox mobile and the rest of the platforms but guys before we do start though i will say that if you guys want to be blessed with insane llama luck then i recommend dropping a like on the video right now because if you guys like the video right now you'll get free llamas spawn right next to you like i did in this video so starting off with the settings you want to go into your video settings and make sure that your settings are just like mine you want your view distance on near your shadows and anti-aliasing both off and your textures effects and post processing turned to low the reason for this setting is because it actually makes the llamas stand out as the buildings and textures won't load in as fast and also won't be as detailed which makes the llamas stand out more and easier for us to spot the next setting that you want to change is the brightness now for the brightness i did test a few of these out and what i found was that having brightness on 1.0 is the best for me like i could literally see llamas straight away from the bus i did also try the default brightness and i could spot llamas but it was much harder to see them than it was with having the brightness on max the final brightness test i did was having the brightness on zero the lowest this was a pretty bad setting for me as it was just too dark and i was really having a hard time spotting them for you guys though i recommend trying a few of them out for yourselves however i do recommend starting on the highest brightness first Moving on to the final and most important setting, the colorblind mode. For colorblind mode, I also tested all of these out and I found that Deuteranope 10 was the best for me and it's also the setting I'd recommend you guys start off on first. I did try the rest of the colorblind settings out and in my opinion, I found that having colorblind mode off was second best to Deuteranope 10. And guys, that's all the settings you need. In my opinion, the best setting for spotting llamas is having the brightness on 1.0 and the colorblind mode set to Deuteranope 10. Also, all of my external settings like my nvidia settings and monitor settings are just on the default as well now let's move on and i'll show you guys how to actually spot the llamas so to start off you want to load into a game once in game you want to jump out of the battle bus and pull your glider straight away now what we're looking for here is a sort of white slash purple ish pixel you want to scan your eyes over the map and search for a pixel that looks out of place once you spot the pixel slash dot you want to line it up with your crosshair and hit your ping button this will confirm if it's a llama or if it isn't a good tip for you guys is to try and spot the llamas while you're high up in the air because as you ascend down the more the map starts rendering in and it makes it harder to spot them at first you guys might mistake rocks and cars for llamas but after you've tried this a few times you'll be able to easily distinguish between those two i do recommend that you guys start off with looking over grassy open areas first then move on to the snow and desert biomes you've got to remember though guys the more you do practice this the better you will get at it for how good this method can be in a real game is something i'm not too sure on i think it depends on your playstyle and how much llama luck you actually have like say if you're playing in an arena mode or in a qualifier and each spot is being contested this method of jumping out the bus straight away and scanning for llamas might be something you actually want to consider as the total amount of llamas that can spawn on the map is five i can't do this myself right now as i'm not the best at it but after practice i'll be able to do it easily and five llamas is a lot considering what you get in the llamas you can potentially get shields, weapons, and the mats that you actually get from them are amazing too. You get 350 of each material, that's wood, metal, and brick. And guys, what I will also say is that you can just turn off these settings after spotting the llamas. Like when you're landing, for example, you can just go into your settings quickly, turn off colorblind mode, and set your brightness to default again. It's really as simple as that. Same with the hood. If you make any changes to the hood to make it easier to spot them, you can just revert them to while you're landing. Let me know in the comments below, guys, if you are going to try this method and if not tell me why also because i'm curious yeah that's all I got for today guys i do want to give a massive shout out to kamikaze as he was the og that actually made this method popular i'll leave a link to his channel below it's actually definitely worth checking out guys especially the video he did of him actually spotting llamas like he can spot like five of them from spawn which is just insane so i'll leave a link to his channel and that video below but yeah guys that's all from me i hope to see you guys in the next video thanks for watching peace